Hi everyone, I wanted to show you this great new feature within Google Docs. So let's say I am a student and I am doing a research paper on Abraham Lincoln. I'm going to title my document real quick. And I am going to access the research tool by going to Tools, Research. And what happens is a little Google search bar pops up over here on the side. There's a couple really cool things about this search bar. First of all, right here you can search for everything which means it just searches the internet like Google would normally do. You can search for images directly or you can search for quotes. You also have a settings button down at the bottom of this bar and the default is not filtered by license. So this will get you any images, any quotes, any websites that Google would normally return. But here's the cool thing. You can actually take copyright into consideration while doing your search. So if you drop this down and change this to free to use, share, or modify even commercially, that means these images that will be returned will be copyright free. So now I'm going to go back up to the top and I'm going to put in Abraham Lincoln. And you'll see I get some results. I have couple pictures up here at the top. I have a little bit of information about him which I can expand if I want. I've got a sample quote of websites that I can use. But here's the cool thing. If I go right up here to where this G is, right now it's on an everything search. I can change it to an image search and now it's only going to give me images that like I said are free for reuse. So let's say I want to use this very first one in my paper. I simply click, drag it over to my paper. It inserts it right into my Google Doc and guess what the amazing thing is? Check down at the bottom. It has put a one at the bottom of my picture. And it automatically inserts a footnote to cite the picture. Likewise, if I choose a quote, um, so I've changed my search to quote here at the top, and then I go down, I find the quote I want. I find it, and I choose insert. It adds my quote right up at the top of my page. And check it out. It also adds a citation for the quote. How cool is that? There is one more feature I would like to show you. I've shown you images and quotes. I'm going to go back to my everything search. And let's say I, right here in my um, document, I have a paragraph and I would like to include either a citation or a link within my paragraph. So this is my sentence about Lincoln. And so let's say right here, I need to include a little footnote or a citation. And I have found this information on this particular website right here. Notice I have three options, preview, insert, link, or site. Preview just pops up a little window right here so you can kind of get an idea what the site looks like. Um, but the cool thing is I can say insert a citation and right here it's going to put a three and add to my footnotes at the bottom. That, this, that I found this information on this particular website does my citation for me. Um, also, if I was typing something that I wanted to give you a link to, I could simply click on the website I want to share the link to, click insert link, and it's going to label the link for me and then create a hyperlink to that site. 